just update you all that to come but I just want to update you in a little bit more detail on those uh, pictures that we're just receiving from New York from Manhattan as you can see people being stretched away there by the emergency services uh, the latest we're hearing from police and fire officials is that up to 50 people injured when the, the ferry from New Jersey uh, struck a dock during rush hour in lower Manhattan today the Staten Island ferry as it's uh, described um, the C Street Wall Street catamaran uh, from Atlantic Heights in New Jersey, banged into the mooring apparently as it arrived uh, in Lower Manhattan. Officials say one person is in a critical condition with head injuries. Um, a little bit earlier on we saw that some patients were uh, carried off the ferry, strapped to flatboard stretchers, their heads and their necks immobilised just to be on the safe side really, don't want any more neck injuries. About a dozen passengers on those stretchers were previously uh, stretched out uh, on the dock side there, many of those now having been taken to waiting ambulances. Uh, a corner of the ferry, you can't see that just at the moment, apparently reports suggesting that it's been ripped open like a tin can is how it's been described. Happened around about a quarter to nine in the morning, five hours behind us here in the UK. Um, we believe uh, that uh, local police, I think we can see the... Um, can we see the hole, the damage? There we can, we can see the damage there on the C Street, Wall Street um, catamaran ferry as it uh, arrived and hit the dock there very hard indeed, um, jolting many of the passengers, up to 50 of them having been injured. One of them is said to have serious head injuries uh, in a critical condition, taken to hospital. Others uh, taken via these um, hard boards and, and laying on the uh, ferry side while the ambulances were called now most of them having been taken to a hospital we'll get more information we'll update you further